I'll just try eating my foot? Okay, I'm two years old and I'm already eating my foot. What is going on, TFG squad? My name is Brandon and welcome back to Nirvana. So I played this last week. You guys loved it. I really loved it. So let's get back into the game. So this is a game where you start as a baby and you're trying to get to 750 years old. And last video, I died at 29. Um... I was a little bit off of 750. My name was Sherry Price. Okay, what's my name this time? I'm Curtis Moore, and I'm a bald baby that's one years old. Okay, let's get started. You are teething, and it hurts. I can bite a chew toy, or I can bite mom's chewy finger. Are we going to be a bad baby, or are we going to be a good person? Well, you know what? I'm going to try to get as close to 750 as possible. Let's be a good baby for now. Let's bite the chew toy. It's feeding time, but your mom is nowhere to be seen. Crying will surely get her attention. Mom! Or I'll just try eating my foot? Okay, I'm two years old, and I'm already eating my foot. I'm going to just cry like a baby, because that seems like the right thing to do. Oh, also, by the way, you see those four icons at the top? If they get too low or too high, you die. Like last time I was doing good. I got my popularity all the way up and then someone killed me because I was too popular. It's time for bed. Which story would you like mommy to read you? Good night for the good night? Sounds like a good story for a baby. Dreams about Teddy Krueger. Okay, that sounds terrifying. It kind of sounds like a cross between Freddy Krueger and Five Nights at Freddy's. You know what? We're going to go with the good night for a good night for now. Uh-oh. My happiness is getting a little too high, though. I need, to, I need to make sure I get my happiness a little lower. A stranger approached you with some very tasty-looking candies. Oh, my gosh. Yum, yum, or... Mom said not to talk to strangers. Um, I want to get my happiness a little lower, so I'm going to do that. It raised my happiness? Okay. Apparently, if you see a creepy stranger coming out of a, a creepy van and he has candies, take them because you'll be happier. You, you'll probably die, but apparently you'll be happier. Okay, now my happiness level is way too high. I'm five years old. I, it looks like I've got a blonde mohawk. And I'm about to die because I'm too happy. This is just fantastic. You got lost in the crowd at the amusement park. Do you remember what your parents told you to do in this situation? Wait until they come back and don't go anywhere. Go ride the tallest roller coaster. Okay, um, I'm going to go to the right because I think riding the roller coaster is probably going to make me happier. I'm a five-year-old kid and I'm going to ride the tallest roller coaster. That seems like a bad idea. Okay. I never thought I'd be so happy for my happiness levels to go down. Your parents found you after you spent hours crying and told you what a blast they had without you. Okay, I, I have the world's worst parents in the world. They literally stranded a five-year-old baby in an amusement park, and they had a great time. They didn't even miss me. Okay, I'm six years old, and I look terrifying right now. Okay, have my goals changed? No, I haven't gotten a best friend. Okay, let's see. The mailman has left a box in front of your house. It has your mom's name on it. Let's open it and commit a federal crime. So I'm going to be a six-year-old in jail, or let's just get it inside the house. Um, I'm going to, uh, I don't know which one to, I'm going to commit a federal crime. What? My happiness levels went up again? Okay. Apparently, uh, felonies are fun now. You accidentally broke one of your mom's favorite porcelain statues. What should you do? Confess and tell her it was me. Yeah, right. I'm not confessing to that. Or hide the pieces inside a flower pot? Okay, so mom walks downstairs to water the plants and BAM! Her finger just fell off because she cut it on the broken pieces. I'm gonna go to the right. I don't even- Oh, man. Okay, my popularity and my money are really low. Mom was furious. She scolded you for an hour and took away your allowance. Mom, you should thank me because all of your fingers haven't fallen off yet. Okay, my money levels are really low, so I need to find a way to get that level as high as possible. Your parents just told you that you are adopted. How do you feel about that? I'm so happy that I'm not genetically related to these psychopaths. Okay. <laughs> So your parents just told you that you were adopted and you're actually happy because of how crazy your parents are. Well, they did leave me stranded at an amusement park, so that kind of lines up. This is literally the most depressing news I've ever gotten. Um, I, I don't know. I'm, I, I don't really care. I'm going to go to the right. It got my popularity too high. Now I could die because I either don't have enough money or I'm just too happy. You need to make a presentation tomorrow. Should you work overtime? That'll get me money. 
Yes, I need to finish it today. What's the other option? I just want to get home already. No, no, no. I need to finish it today. My money went up. Okay, at least I'm not about to die. What did I get to age 29 last time? I want to at least get to 30. Hey, my guy's got a beard now. Whoa, I'm 22. Your boss is firing you for wearing too much of the colors he hates? What kind of boss is that? This is definitely going to hurt my money. Fine, I'll switch colors every second day. Uh, okay, you can't fire me. I quit. No, that's gonna kill my money. All right I gotta I gotta wear different colors because my boss doesn't like my blue shirts Okay, my money went up. Okay. That was actually the right decision as unreasonable as it was a friend asked you to take care of his cat for a few days He's willing to pay you. I love animals. What could go wrong? My happiness went down What? Hey, I used to take care of my neighbor's cat. I, I, I kind of liked it. His name was Oscar. Okay, the cat is making a mess all around the house, breaking and scratching everything in his path. Uh, look at him. He's so cute. Or get out of my house, you filthy animal. Oh, this cat's in my house. Oh, okay. We're going to say he's so cute. Uh, okay. Things are not going well right now. A poor beggar is begging you for some money. Buddy. I should be the one begging. I have no money right now. Can you not see the little money bar above my head? Oh my gosh. Here you go. You're buy yourself some. No, I'm not going to have them buy alcohol. Get a job. Yeah, that's what I'm going to do. It actually made me money. Apparently, if you see a beggar on the side of the street and you don't give him money, you make more money. That makes no sense. Free donuts. Okay. I like free stuff. There's a catch. Um, there's definitely going to be a catch, but I just want to see what happens. I like free stuff. Uh, they were poisoned. You should have known there was a catch. Did I just die? No, I didn't die, but my health went down. Okay. <laughs> of course, someone offers me free donuts and they're poisoned. A friend got himself in trouble and needs you to bail him out of jail. I mean, Curtis Moore, which is my name. I, I must be the worst person in the world. My parents leave me in an amusement park. I have friends that are in jail and need me to bail them out. I mean, this is just ridiculous. I'll help him out, and then my money's gonna go down. Let him suffer for his mistakes. Uh, I, I, yeah, that's what I'm gonna do. My popularity was getting a little too high anyway, so that helped me out. Your mother is getting old and forgetful. You can check her into a nursing home and forget about her for yourself. Um... Okay, she'll find many friends there. She can move in without me. Well, she did keep me stranded at an amusement park, so fine, I'll check her in. Oh, and it hurt my money. You are still wearing the same clothes you've been wearing as a teenager. Isn't it time to buy new clothes? No, because I don't have any money. Also, I'm still wearing the same clothes that I was wearing as a teenager. That's kind of embarrassing. Your tooth hurts. Maybe it's time to visit a dentist? Uh, I should visit a dentist every six months. I actually just went to the dentist to get a cavity filled the other day. It was not that bad, actually. Uh, I'm not paying someone to torture me, okay? I mean, yes, sometimes going to the dentist can feel like torture, but I think they're trying to help you in the long run. We're gonna go to the dentist. Oh, it cost me money. Don't I have dental insurance? A woman you have been dating wants you to marry her for some reason. Sure, why not? Could you imagine that? Your your girlfriend of five years is like, hey, do you want to get married? And you're just like, I guess, fine. Or, we barely know each other. Well, I actually don't know how long this guy's been dating her. I'm going to say, sure, why not? I, I'm a married man. I am a married man. I have no money left to my name, but I am a married man. And I guess that's a ring. I, okay, that's wonderful. Your microwave is no longer microwaving. Well, I, I have no money to replace it. So I'm just gonna, I'll sell it and use it as a safe. I sold a microwave to a person and they used it as a, as a safe for their money. You attended a wedding where you saw the school bully who used to pick on you. Should you say hello? We were just kids back then. He's probably changed or... I'll humiliate him by pulling his pants down in front of everyone. Okay, I am the, the most immature 44-year-old man in the world. Um, but that's what I'm gonna do. My happiness level went up. <laughs> that's strange. It seems like you have more money in your bank account than you should. Should you notify someone? So you logged into your bank account. You had $8.35. You log in. You got $8,000 now. Do you tell anybody? Um... I'm not going to tell anybody. It's my money now. What? Why did my money go down? The bank found out its own mistake and fixed it by making an opposite mistake. 
So now instead of having the $35.83, I got nothing. A naked hitchhiker is trying to catch a ride. Will you help him? No! If you guys are ever driving on the side of the road and a naked man walks up to you, drive away. Maybe take out a, a sword and bop him in the head with it. What What is going on in this game? Poor guy, he seems kind of lost. No, I'm not going to let him in. What a loser. Well, I mean, I probably won't call him a loser, but I'm not going to let him in my house. Although in this game... Come on in, buddy! He said someone had stolen all of his clothes and left them there. He is far away from home, and it's getting dark. I'll invite him to stay at my place tonight. This is not going well. I am going to end up dead if I let this guy in my house. Or take him to the nearest gas station. Well, that just seems mean. I'm continuing the story with the naked guy. I'm going to invite him in my house. He might try to steal something. You can keep an eye on him if both of you sleep in the same bed. Come on! Now I gotta sleep with this naked homeless man? A slumber party would be awesome! You had spent a wonderful night together. The next day, he made sure to pay you for your troubles. Okay! Apparently, the naked homeless man has money. I'm getting way too popular, by the way. I need to get my popularity down. Your parents are getting a divorce and your mother is planning to move in with you. I'm a 50-year-old man. How old are my parents? I just figured my parents were dead at this point. I didn't, they're like 88 years old and getting divorced now. Like, they they were married for 55 years, and now they decided, eh, I'm kind of tired of you. That's a strange time to get a divorce. Um, I could use her company. No way. Oh, man. Both of these affect my popularity, but I don't know which one affects it. I think if I say, I think if I let my mom live with me, I would be less popular, right? Maybe? No, my popularity went up? Okay, apparently I'm 50 years old living with my mom, and that made my popularity higher. You get, She gave you half the money she's gotten from your dad. Okay, so I got more money out of it, but now I'm dying of popularity. It just asked me if I wanted to go to a haunted house, and I said yes, and now everything got scary and dark. Okay, you are standing in a dusty living room. There is a rotting stench in the air. Let's see what's in the kitchen. I've got to use the bathroom for a minute. Um, oh no. Are these affecting my popularity and I don't even know how? Let's see what's in the kitchen. The kitchen is full of cockroaches. They seem to be coming from upstairs. Seems smart to follow the cockroach trail. No, it doesn't. I've just remembered. I have to go to the bathroom. Okay, this guy really wants to go to the bathroom. Let's let him go to the bathroom. The whole bathroom floor is covered with faces. Oh, feces. Something is making a terrible noise inside the toilet. I'll just take a peek inside. I'll just go back to the kitchen. Let's look inside the toilet. Uh-oh. There was an alligator in the toilet? It has eaten your head, and now you are dead. Curtis Moore has died at the age of 51 due to being a stupid person who makes stupid decisions. Curtis Moore's last words were, I'll just take a peek inside. And then he got eaten by an alligator. Don't forget to hit that subscriber button and check out my vlog channel, TFG Vlogs. I have a new vlog every single Sunday. You guys will love those vlogs. So go over there right now and subscribe. And I will see all of you in the next video. Next time I see an alligator in a toilet, I'm gonna run.